This video tutorial from Folkstrite will guide you through how to set up your Sapphire Pro interface with Apple's Logic software, ready to record and playback audio. The first step you need to take is to download the latest version of Sapphire Mix Control from the support pages on the Focusrite website. Once you have done this, you can connect to your interface and open up the Sapphire Mix Control software. Then, open Logic. You will then need to create a new project. This is the screen that you'll see once you've created a new project. You will now need to configure the audio preferences so that the Sapphire is being used. Click on Preferences and then click on Audio. This brings up the audio preferences. You'll see a list of devices under Device. Click on this and select Sapphire. Also on this page, you'll see input and output buffer size. By reducing this, you can reduce the latency when recording and playing back audio. Beware though, reducing this will require greater CPU power and if there isn't enough available resources, your audio performance may decrease. Once you have set your settings, Click Apply Changes. This may take a moment as it has to initialize. Once it's done it, you may now close the preferences. The Sapphire is now ready to use for recording and playing back audio. If you click on Input for a channel, you can see a list of the available inputs of the Sapphire. I'm using a Pro 24, so there's 16 available inputs. To see which inputs these correspond to on your Sapphire, Check the user manual. There is also a list of available outputs under Outputs. These correspond to the door outputs in your Sapphire Mix Control software. Let's select 1 to 2 and configure Sapphire Mix Control to output door 1 and door 2. Open up Sapphire Mix Control. The easiest way to set door 1 and door 2 to all outputs is to choose Routing Preset and Door Tracking. As you can see, this sets door 1 and door 2 to all outputs, including the headphones and the monitor outputs. Any audio played back from Logic will now come out of your monitors or headphones. If you wish to set up a mix of zero latency input and your door, door output, use the mixer at the top of Sapphire Mix Control. To get more guidance on how to use this mixer, Please see the Sapphire Mix Control tutorial on our website.